in this video i am going to discuss about how to uh, convert uh, time series data from one frequency to a different frequency uh, normally in time series uh, analysis uh, we uh, uh, come across a different uh, frequency of time series data uh, sometime it could be monthly sometime it could be quarterly half yearly uh, weekly or daily data uh, and many a times we need to convert uh, this uh, frequency into uh, a different uh, frequency so how do we do that so uh, in sas uh, proc expand helps us uh, in converting uh, one form of time series to a different form um, so here is the example i'll take uh, an example of a monthly data so i'm going to use this particular data set uh, you can get this data set in sas help is the uh, ar data where uh, is is a monthly data uh, where you have uh, uh, there is uh, international uh, air travel which is the number of travel uh, in a particular month that's the uh, the value and it it's a monthly series so let's try to convert this into a quarterly series so we'll use proc expand data and then input data set is air uh, and then we'll uh, save it in a out data set uh, and we'll give it a name and then uh, from month to quarter so that's pretty much the syntax and then what we are going to uh, convert here is the variable right uh, the variable air so convert air and the id variable is state remember uh, in time series data you always use uh, uh, an id variable um, and now when we run this we'll get the quarterly data previously we had the monthly data now we have the uh, quarterly data you can see first quarter and the second quarter third quarter fourth quarter and so on and gets repeated for the next year similarly let's take another example where we uh, are converting the monthly data to weekly data uh, where uh, in the first case we were expanding where uh, we are doing the opposite uh, in in the second case where you know the frequency is actually uh, shortening now um, so we are converting monthly to uh, monthly data to weekly data so the syntax remains same except the fact that uh, here from is month and two is week uh, and rest of the syntax remains same so let us run this okay when we run this we will get uh, the new data set where we'll have uh, the weekly data and for uh, you know it, it it interpolates and uh, gives us uh, approximate values of uh, weekly uh, data so that's how we can uh, convert uh, time series data uh, and into different uh, frequencies and based on the requirement we can uh, uh, always uh, you know get one kind of frequency data from um, for the given data from the given data set